Well, this is my latest and greatest find. This is the number two Mark IV F uh, Lee Enfield. This is the last at Lee Enfield they made. This is commonly called the Irish contract. Uh, it was made mainly for the Royal Irish Constabulary and for export to Canada, Ireland, and a few other places. Uh, it's a pretty nice rifle. It's in pretty good shape. And it came with the correct bayonet, the correct uh, ban or excuse me, the correct uh, sling, bayonet, bayonet. Uh, I don't know what you call it, the, the cap, and the frog. So it had it had everything with it. It has a brass uh, butt plate, and it's all complete. Just it's a cool looking uh, example of the British rifle of World War II. Though this one was made in 1954, as I said, it's the last model that they made before they went to the FNFAL, and then later uh, rifles as well. Uh, I've I've looked at. Uh, Oh, what's his name? Uh, uh, Jonathan Ferguson's book on, uh, well, it's mainly on bullpups, but uh, his interesting book on, on British rifles. And he does, as an aside, mention this particular one in there. It's nothing fancy, really. It's just an interesting rifle. But I didn't have, well, the closest thing I had to a Lee Enfield was this. And this is not a Lee Enfield. What this is is a... a a sporterized rifle built on a Lee Enfield action, but that's a new barrel in uh, 3040 Craig. Uh, and as you see, it's it's mainly set up as a deer rifle. It's a, it's an, a nice, very nice gun, uh, very accurate, but uh, it wasn't a military surplus Lee Enfield. This came in. They also had a jungle carbine, but I couldn't afford it. Uh, so I bought this.